Moving on to Sunday, New Year's Day, we begin with the Colts at the New York Giants. The Giants are three-point favorites here. Full disclosure, I am recording this. The Indianapolis Colts have not yet completed their game against the Los Angeles Chargers, so I don't know whether they pulled off the upset, as I predicted last week, or what the sort of status of things is. The Colts are trotting out quarterback who, I don't know, how he's still playing in the NFL. Uh, Nick Foles, a guy who has had about 17 shots at being a starter, uh, obviously has that iconic 2017 run with the Eagles. But aside from that, he's just been completely subpar his entire career. Uh, It feels like ownership is meddling so much with this Colts roster uh, in doing things like benching Matt Ryan the first time, now benching him a second time, uh, both times for guys who are pretty clearly inferior to him. I don't think Matt Ryan's been a world beater this year, but I think he's sort of the least of their problems offensively. This offensive line has been paper mache, and just their scheming has just been ugly the entire season. The Colts are a dumpster fire. Even if they do pull off this victory against the Chargers tonight, as I'm predicting they will, I love the Giants minus three here. Feels like a sharp line, so I could see this being a tight, close game where maybe if it gets to three and a half, I'd stay away. For now, give me the Giants minus three. The Giants have been finding new ways to lose every week, including against the Vikings last week, but overall, they're a well-coached roster. They're a well-coached team. Over-under in this game set at 41 and a half, so this is almost a teaser game, but I don't really feel comfortable teasing a Nick Foles and the Colts at this point, even if they do pull out a victory in his first game. So give me the Giants here, minus three, uh, the first game of our Sunday slate.